Marquette had a great week in the Maui Invitational. Even though they ended up losing in the championship to Purdue, they were awesome playing the whole week. And the hub of their offense is Ashu Iguodaro. So he is great playing from the extended elbows and then also in delay. So right here, he's going to catch it, elbow extended, similar to pistol action you see a lot in the NBA when they use their fives to play from the extended elbow and a lot of chase action and zoom actions and back cuts. So right here, they're going to go zoom action, which is the down screen. Now, this offensive player right here is going to come off this dribble handoff. He could turn the corner. Now you're playing two on one right here downhill. And this is one of his favorite shots. And he is elite at this little push floater right here from the dots. Marquette pushing in transition right here. So right here, you got pistol action or 21 action. He's going to keep it. Throw it right to the elbow extended. A hand back right there. So now, once again, you're playing two on one. Right into a little touch floater. He's excellent at keeping the ball moving. He's very ball friendly because he can catch it right here. He can turn the corner and attack downhill, which we'll see. He can go right back to a hand back. He can dribble out a player or he can pass the ball very well. You can see on this back cut right here to a finish. Pistol action right to the extended elbow. Now they're playing right out of him. Back cut, similar to what we just saw. Now he catches it at the elbow. He can attack downhill. He sees opposite right there for an open three. He keeps the ball moving, and he can be the hub of your offense right here. Now, once again, this is extended elbow, pistol five action, right into a hand back, into a sit behind three. Catches it. Now he can throw that back cut pass right there and watch his progression right here. He's going to catch it. Once this offensive player back cuts right there, he can also read that the low defenders pulled over. So when he throws that pass, it's going to get through and then the offensive player can finish. This was an ATO right there. So pistol five, extended elbow. They're going to go punch action, which is where you throw it into the mid post right here. He's going to veer down right into a screen. Now they're playing two on one again. He's able to catch it and then finish at the rim. Delay action right here, but now it's going to go into a dribble handoff right here. He keeps it. Nothing right here. Now he can attack. He flows right into a ball screen. This is excellent. Just watch the offense move, and they have great spacing playing around him. He's going to keep it. He turns the corner. This is a huge bucket right here because they're down one against UCLA, and you can just see the movement of their offense playing through him as the hub. Now he can attack downhill. So watch right here. He's going to pound evade. So that little jab, he attacks through the bump right into a little open step push floater. He was incredible all week at Maui. And that's one of the reasons Marquette will have a lot of success this year.